Hello everyone, it's Old Guardian here. Algalon the Observer is a neutral legendary card from Hearthstone's Titans expansion with a battle cry replace your hero power with Algalon's Vision. And Algalon's Vision allows your hero power to check the top card on your opponent's deck and either put it in the bottom or leave it there. So pretty interesting stuff going on. But who is Algalon the Observer? In World of Warcraft, Algalon is a constellar who has been designated by the Titans to monitor the planet of Azeroth for signs of corruption. And if necessary, Algalon also has the power to activate Forge of Origination, which can purge all life and all corruption from the entire planet. Blizzard has not went into great detail on who the constellars are exactly. Constellars are these kinds of humanoid beings that look like constellations and they often serve the Titans. They have been used as watchers for the Titans in many, many planets. Did the Titans create constellars? Are constellars a separate race that was already there? Are they related to Titans somehow? Because in some forms Titans do have constellar-like appearances. That one we don't know exactly, but we do know that constellars often do work for Titans. Algalon is also not the first constellar to appear in Hearthstone. There have been two constellars before Algalon, Orion, Mansion Manager, and Harbinger Celestia. However, both of these constellars are Hearthstone originals, and it kind of doesn't make sense that there would be lots of constellars on Azeroth, like Algalon wasn't spending time on Azeroth all the time. Algalon would be summoned to Azeroth to make his determinations, but he didn't spend the whole time on Azeroth. So these really, I don't think these are like canon like real. But we have seen Algalon in World of Warcraft. Because during Wrath of the Lich King, the players defeated the corrupted Keeper Loken, who was the prime designate of Titans on Azeroth at the time, and his death summoned Algalon to Azeroth to run a determination on what is the level of corruption in the world. And that determination initially didn't go too well for Azeroth, but luckily our heroes were able to save the day and even make Algalon reconsider his choices. Maybe we can rig the systems to interfere with his analysis. Translocation complete. Commencing planetary analysis of Azeroth. Stand back, mortals. I'm not here to fight you. It is in the universe's best interest to re-originate this planet should my analysis find systemic corruption. Do not interfere. Your actions are illogical. All possible results for this encounter have been calculated. The Pantheon will receive the Observer's message regardless of outcome. See your world through my eyes. A universe so vast as to be immeasurable, incomprehensible even to your greatest minds. I have seen worlds bathed in the Maker's flames, their denizens fading without so much as a whimper. Entire planetary systems born and raised in the time that it takes your mortal hearts to beat once. Yet all throughout, my own heart devoid of emotion, of empathy, I have felt nothing. A million, million lives wasted. Had they all held within them your tenacity? Had they all loved life as you do? Perhaps it is your imperfection, that which grants you free will, that allows you to persevere against all cosmically calculated odds. You prevail where the Titan's own perfect creations have failed. I've rearranged the reply code. Your planet will be spared. I cannot be certain of my own calculations anymore. So, after Algalon realized that his calculations were inaccurate, he allowed Azeroth to continue living, but still kept watching it. Algalon was not destroyed, he was merely defeated. And then Algalon's story took a pretty whimsical turn, I suppose. I'm not even sure. Can this be considered canon? Anyway, you won't guess what Algalon did next. 
because Algalon got a little bit bored of watching Azeroth and decided to take on battle pet training. And then Algalon became a battle pet trainer that in World of Warcraft you can defeat with your own battle pets in this mini game of battle pet combat. Yeah, that happened. Anyway, as the Constellar in charge of watching over Azeroth and making sure that Azeroth doesn't become corrupted as the Herald of the Titans, Algalon is one of the more powerful beings that have ever visited the planet. And now he's also available in Hearthstone. Thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And a special thanks to all of my Patreon supporters, YouTube members and Twitch subscribers who make all of these videos possible.